Hi guys, how are you? It's Anna. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be filming and planning the week of the 19th through the 25th of March. And I'm using this beautiful kit here from Beautiful Planning. It is a printable kit and it's called Muggle Struggle. I got this kit from Sonia as a gift and I am in love. And so happy that she did because the kit that I bought for this week, oh my God, it was so disappointing. Uh, uh, no, I, I didn't even print it out. That's... I don't even know what possessed me to buy it. Anyway, I love these colors. These colors are gorgeous. It's like, remind me of spring. And the kit that I bought, um, it didn't do that. It was really dark colors. And I'm like, I don't even know what possessed me, like I said. Anyway, we want to talk about it because we have this kit here, this gorgeous kit. So, yeah, Sonia gifted to me, and I am happy. As you can see here, I'm, like, going through the pages, like, wait, wait, what's, something's missing. Yes, something's missing. I forgot to print out the sheet that had all the glitter headers and the littles. So, I'm taking this little strip that was for the bottom washi for the top here to cover up the green headers. And I'm going to do the same on the other side, and then I try to do this crazy thing of putting washi strips for headers and yeah I just scratched it you'll see me do like maybe three and then I just scratch the whole thing and I'm just doing a different um planning style for this week which is going to be more of as let me see what is it called plan as I go so yeah as you can see right now yeah I just scratched everything out and just started start doing my sidebar because I was so upset so of course I'm using this blue um with the girl with the blue because I am a raven's claw I am and I am a true raven's claw witty intelligent all that I I am and my daughter my oldest daughter is like you are a true raven claw that is you you really belong in the house and my oldest daughter she is a hufflepuff and she is a true hufflepuff because she you know artistic and everything shy and all that she she is a true hufflepuff but my other daughter and son, I haven't tested them yet, so we will see if I could try to get them to take the test. Anyway, what house do you belong in? Because I would love to know. It's just, you know, intriguing that you'd be placed in a house, and if you do like the house, and be like, wait, that is me. I am a true either Slytherin or Hufflepuff or even just, you know, Whatever house you're in, Gryffindor, whatever, are you a true house? Like, is that your true house? Because I would love to know. I'd love to know. Um, so, as you can see, I'm starting off from uh, the beginning on Monday. In the very top, I used a flag from the kit and a little script sticker with the coffee cup that says, but first, coffee. And here I am struggling with this label just to put down that... My daughter, Kelani, went back to college. Her spring break was over. And these books are from Stickerific. And at first I put the wrong color down because I don't know why I chose a purple one because there's no purple in this kit. But this one here is has green, the blue, and the yellow. It matches perfectly. So then I put down this full box that says, Life's a struggle when you're a muggle. Which is <laughs> so funny because the way that it plays on the word struggle with muggle. Anyway. So now I am putting down this three heart check box and that is to represent, oh wait, 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 I, do you see this? I ripped my planner. Oh, I was so heated when I did that. Anyway, <laughs> I did planner surgery and put some glue on it. So here I'm trying to put back this label, which I'm struggling. As you can see, these nails are too long for me. I need to cut them. Anyway. And I'm just trying to get everything down straight because I want to use this dainty little sticker from Templar Craft. That's one here that says planning time. And then I'm just going to fill in later, film, edit, and upload. So underneath that, I am going to put um, this hydrate sticker and a movie marquee that will signify that I opened my shop. Oh my God, I'm still so excited. Anyway, you have to check it out. I will link that down below, and I will also link down Sonia's Instagram page because she is my PR, and she has a PR code that you can use that has no limit with it. And, yeah, go ahead and take advantage of that. So now moving on to Tuesday. Tuesday, um, House Pride belongs to Hufflepuff. So I have 
the yellow half box there with some flowers and stickers just on the side to signify that it was the first day of spring. And as you can see here, I'm going to lay down um, this green to-do box, the bow to-do box, which I was not supposed to because I got confused and I put, thought that it was a Slytherin's day and it wasn't. Yeah, see, this is where you see it. That a little washi strip with the little sticker of the bow with the paperclip bow, that is from um, Paper and Gumption, and that is to signify my first sale. I had my first sale on that day. But I will switch the position up after because I was supposed to have this research. Well, this is what I'm going to signify that. Oh, and this little magnifying glass is from Paper and Gumption as well. So cute. It does signify that I did some research for some digital paper shop. Etsy digital paper shop. So, yeah. You'll see that after. I will switch it. Bingo. The power editing. But I forgot to take out that check heart. Um, box to do box yeah I'm pointing to it now it's supposed to be yellow and I forgot but I will take it out with undo and I will switch it out to a yellow one later like right now as you can see what I put down on Wednesday is a little pencil that says early release it's for my son he had an early release day because it was supposed to be a major storm coming that day and everything stood under us, like New York got it, um, New Jersey, and even Maryland and Washington got it really bad. We didn't get nothing. I mean, when we say nothing, it's nothing to us. It's like not even two inches, put it that way. And they made a big ta-da, you know, about it. Ta-da or to-do, a to-do about it. So, yeah. Anyway, it was a dud. So now I'm going to go ahead and put down this full box here. And I do have that green little bow divider to divide the box up. I think those bow dividers are so cute. I like them a lot. And then I'm going to go ahead and put down this appointment label that will signify with a obsessed with cute design sticker that I was designing that day as well. I was trying to design a new kit. And yeah, I'm sorry, but the design sticker is is from a such a cute like I said and she is no longer a shop but I do have the printable so that's why I still use them so underneath that I'm going to put down my hydrate sticker and then I noticed that I forgot to put one on Tuesday so I will go back and put one on Tuesday later on so underneath the hydrate sticker I'm going to put down this label and I am also going to be using a laptop sticker from the kit and, and that will be to denote that I did YouTube binging. Binging? Binging. 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 Okay. All right. <laughs> I got it right. So, yeah. And then underneath that, I'm going to use the half box with the bow. And that is going to represent that I created Sonia's PR code. That's so exciting to do all that. I'm just, like, so excited. So, anyway, moving on to Thursday. And Thursday is... Um, Gryffindor House Pride. So you have Hufflepuff, uh, Slytherin, and Gryffindor. And I notice how I put those two stickers almost in the same spot, but different page. I was trying to keep the illusion of it looking like one continuous sticker, even though the spring, you know, not the spring, what am I saying, the coil is there. Um, it came out all right, but I think it looked cute either way. So here I am going to put down this half, not a half, this flag from the kit and that top priority sticker is from Paper and Gumption. I had a very important appointment, personal, can't say, but it was a very important appointment that I could not miss. So underneath the full box, I put down another um, appointment label and this, 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 this is a scope. I can't say that right. <laughs> That's a, I can't say it right. Don't judge me. Don't make fun of me. <laughs> um, it's from Planner. No, Plan. What is it? Planet Southern. And then I'm struggling to put this little arrow down to say don't forget. But it didn't work out. So I put the label back down. And I am going to use a coffee mug. But then I was like, you know what? I could layer it with something else. So I took off the, the coffee cup again put down the laptop, put the coffee cup next to it, and it looks so cute, and that is to represent that I was designing again. 
So underneath that, I'm going to put uh, the half box with the bow, which is so cute, and this other sticker from Paper and Gumption. And that is to represent after I did that, I just relaxed for the rest of the night. And that is my Thursday. Moving on to Friday. Friday is in my house pride, which is, again, Ravenclaw. And so I put another appointment sticker and another whatever that is. <laughs> but this time it's from Temp um, Templar Crafts to signify that my daughter had an x-ray to get done, and I took her to get it done. And here I'm using this half box with that um, breakfast plate from Sticker Sticker Tears, and that is to denote that I went to have breakfast with my daughter after her appointment. Underneath that, I want to put this label with another little denty sticker from Denty. Like I'm saying Denty. This little thin little sticker that says planning time. Um, dainty is what I'm trying to say, um, from Templar Craft to signify that underneath it is something to do with planning. So I am going to put down edit and upload underneath that. And then I'm going to put down my hydrate sticker. I drink a lot of water and I don't even know why I put it because I drink it every day, but I like using them when I have them. You know what I mean? So now I'm going to put down the nine and three quarter full box that is so gorgeous because it has all the colors on it and underneath that for the night I just put another flag and the script sticker that says print and cut so uh, that is my Friday moving on to the weekend I'm gonna go ahead and choose this cute little one for it. I mean I'm glad that she gives you two options of weekend banners to choose from but I really wanted to use this one because I never used this style before so yeah I think it was gorgeous it's so cute um, so underneath of that, I am going to put down this appointment label, if I get to it. There it goes. No, that's not first. The appointment label. Um, that is to signify, which I am also going to put an asterisk little circle um, icon that it was important because I couldn't find an alarm clock on there to signify that we had to wake up really early. I mean, early like 6 o'clock in the morning on Saturday. So that way, me and my girls would go ahead and head down to the casino because we was going to go ahead and meet my cousin and we was going to play bingo. So I put down the half box and this little sticker that says bingo is from Nash Artwork. And yeah, I think it looks cute. And then underneath that, I put another marquee to signify. After that, we had a movie night, and I watched a movie with my daughter and my son. I think it's called I Killed, I, no, I Kill Giants, which is a graphic novel turned to a movie. Almost like this whole Harry Potter thing. But I don't know. I liked the movie, but I just didn't like that they put all four books in one movie. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, it didn't really give us anything to look forward to because it was just done in one movie. So here I'm trying to move this full box a little bit lower because I need it to be just a smidge lower to put down um, my sleeping max that says sleep in because God knows I need it. I run, I run, I ran that whole day on Saturday with just three hours sleep. I, I, I don't even know how I do that, but I do it all the time. So yeah, I went back Saturday and put down the Hydra sticker and then Sunday as well. And underneath Sunday, <laughs> this is going to be so funny, I was like, oh my God, there's a toilet in this kit, there's a toilet in this kit. And the reason why I say it because, and then I put right next to it, it says hashtag adulting suck because my appointment, my appointment, my toilet, we bought a toilet seat to change it out. One, it was giving a hard time because the bolts, I guess, was rusted on there. I don't even know how long that toilet seat been there. And I guess moving the tank we sprung a leak and it was all over the place. It was ridiculous. I was just so annoyed and oh my God, I couldn't believe that all that happened just to, just to switch the toilet seat. Unbelievable. So then underneath that, I put down cleaning and the vacuum and then I'm also going to put on a script sticker that says the struggle is real. And why I put that down is because before all that happened in the bathroom, my daughter cleaned the bathroom. So she cleaned it to get cleaned again because I dirtied it up. <laughs> anyway, so um, underneath that sticker, which you can't hardly see here, but I will put it down shortly. It says, um, planner's going to plan. And that was for this um, 
this plans here, this filming for this week. And I didn't have that much room, but I still squeezed in a little bit. So here I'm just trying to distribute some of the deco and fill in all the little empty spots down. But most of these decos, most of these, <laughs> most of the decos were a little bit too big, so I couldn't put it in. Um, but either way, it was still beautiful. I used the ones that I could, and it still turned out great. I just love how this turned out. See, now I'm putting plan is going to plan. So, yeah, needless to say, this was a gorgeous kit. I'm going to go ahead and show you what I have left of the kit. Um, no, I'm sorry. I'm jumping ahead of myself. I'm going to go ahead and use the date covers. I wasn't sure if I was going to use it or not because I didn't want to be too busy on top. But I, I had to balance out the kit and use the date covers. So, yeah, I, I, I had... <laughs> I'm telling you, I was never so happy to see a toilet sticker in my life than how I was yesterday when I seen it. It was like perfect timing, perfect timing to use this kit. Anyway, so yeah, let me know down in the comment section below. Um, like I said before, what is your house? Do you follow Harry Potter? Did you read the book series or did you just watch the actual movie series? Um, I actually did both, except I didn't have all the books the ones that I did I did read them and then I watched the movies and I was really catching up on the movies this week here um yeah it's really nice to go back and see it because you just you sometimes could figure out things that you didn't figure out before by watching a movie over again same thing as rereading a book like you will notice certain things that you didn't notice before the first time you read them or saw them so yeah I like doing that so this is it. This is how it looks completed. I really love how it looks. These are the stickers that I have left to the kit, which I do have a bunch left, which I'm surprised. But yeah, I really did love this kit. It turned out great. The colors are amazing. So, oh, that's just showing that I actually went back and put in the Hydra sticker and a Bill Do sticker for Tuesday that I forgot and I'm also adding this trash that came with the kit to remind me to take out the garbage Tuesday night for Wednesday morning so yeah um don't forget that I will be linking my shop down below and go ahead and check out my shop even if you're not going to buy anything just go ahead and check it out let me know if you like it or not you know just let me know how it is so yeah I love each and every single one of you and I will see you in my next video Bye-bye.